Hi guys, welcome back to Premier Quick Tips and today we're going to be looking at how to import video and audio uh, into your project. So once you've got Premiere open, uh, you're going to right click here uh, on, the, uh, on the project window and uh, you can go straight to import here or you can go Control i on your keyboard and that'll open up your explorer for the import. Um, so we're going to go here and into here and find our footage here. So where your footage is, you don't have to import one at a time. So start at the top and select everything and then just click open and that's going to import it into your project. So for the sake of organization, when we do this, we, uh, we like to try and keep it neat. You can do this before or after you've imported it. We can do it after now. Um, so again, if we highlight all of our footage and then we right click and we're going to go to new bin from selection, that's going to create a folder of all that footage in. So we're just going to call that footage now. And then once that's done, we also talked about audio. So audio is exactly the same. Import or Control I, open up your finder window, uh, and then we're gonna to go to wherever our uh, audio may be, and just click on that and open that one. And then that's our audio imported there. Now what we can also do, again, we like to do this to keep this neat, is uh, right click on that, and then new bin from selection. You can also, um, create a new bin here if you just right click anywhere in the window so a new bin and then we're going to call it audio once you've done that you can then drag your file into that bin there and then that that bin has all of our footage in and that bin has all of our audio in and then we can really simply just drag that into the timeline uh, and it's there uh, a couple of other things uh, I like to do um, is when you are importing footage so I like having all my footage on the hard drive I'm working on so that if I give it to someone else, they've got everything available. Um, I used to a lot, just straight from my Explorer window, sort of start copying, pasting stuff here and there. What I didn't realize, really simple thing, is when you're in your control I or right click import window, from here, you can actually create new folders uh, and copy and paste and you know move stuff around into where you might want it all to end up. Uh, so if you found that useful, thank you very much and please like and subscribe uh, and check out my other videos.